Today is going to be an interesting vlog because I actually can't show like 98% of my day today. <laughs> Because it's like a whole bunch of teaching with students that I don't actually have permission to have a camera running during the lesson But let me try my best to make something out of this um, out of this video here um, So today was interesting. I went to downtown uh, to kick things off today and I actually bought this camera that I'm actually uh, shooting with right now. I was talking with a friend. I've been looking to improve a lot of the uh, editing and production value of some of my videos and I thought that you know what Let's upgrade. And let's get uh, let's get a different camera. So testing it out now. So far, I really like it. Let me know what you guys think in the comments below. And uh, taught some English. Taught taught some lessons. Starting starting this week, I have three hours of Chinese a week. So every th three days a week, I have Chinese. I listen to Chinese radio. I have my Chinese lessons. I have Chinese um, music on my phone. So I have some Chinese music on my phone. Yeah, I'm trying now to do as much as possible because. Um, I think I maybe I told you I don't remember, but next semester in the winter, I want to I want to go back to university to get a my Ch a degree in in Chinese. And something interesting came up in a, in an English lesson I was teaching. My student asked me like, "Man, Azrin, you speak like five languages. Does it get easier to learn languages after your like second or first or third or whatever language?" And his opinion was, "After three, it must get a lot easier." And I thought about it and I thought yes and no. I think yes it becomes easier because your brain starts to get used to learning different languages, hearing all these different sounds, thinking in different ways, etc. But I think in a lot of ways it's still really challenging. I don't think, I think a lot of people who don't speak many languages feel like oh once you know three, four it must be really easy to pick up the rest. But they don't realize that if you go learn Russian and the languages you speak, and the languages that you speak currently are like are like Chinese, like Mandarin, Cantonese, like Japanese, and like I don't know, like 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 Spanish. Going to learn Russian is going to be very challenging because it's such a different language, right? So I think the reality is that yes, it becomes easier because you start to learn how to think about different languages, etc. But it's still really challenging. It still takes time. It still takes patience. It still takes consistent work, etc. Um, and, and but but I will say this though, when when he said this, it made me think about something. And maybe think about the following that I do think after your I think the second language you learn is the hardest language that you ever learn because it is the first time your brain is thinking about like thinking about things in a completely different language versus your your first language and your brain's not used to making that transition once you've learned that first that second language I think from there the rest are always or generally I think going to be easier than that second language that you learned unless now that I'm talking this out something else occurred to me unless the second language was extremely similar or in the same language family as your first then maybe not or maybe you grew up with that second language so they're kind of both first languages in that scenario in those scenarios maybe not but I think if we were to look at a general rule of thumb I don't know why I showed my thumb but a general rule of thumb would be that the second language is likely going to be the one of the hardest if not the hardest language um, since you're making that transition into learning different languages and thinking in a different way but past there generally I think they'll probably the languages you learn will likely be easier than that second language that you learn so um, yeah I think this will be the end of the vlog the rest of the day is a bunch of teaching that I can't really shoot so I'm gonna eat my food here and I'll see you guys next time bye for now I don't know why I did that I love this camera it's amazing